Hello everyone, Sam here from Stukeland and Walsh Estate Agents in Hereford and welcome to your full virtual tour for number three, Copswood Drive. So this extended four bedroom uh, property is now available to view and as always with our full tours, we're gonna give you a bit of a street scene first of all. Copswood Drive is in the heart of Hampton Dean. It's a cul-de-sac location with a couple of public footpaths and the playing fields just at the entrance and uh, opposite the entrance to Copswood Drive, I should say. So we have a couple of parking spaces just here, the um, single garage just there in front of us, and we also have a low maintenance front garden just here as well, with side access through to the rear garden, which we'll see a little bit later on. But for now, we're gonna head through the double glazed door to the front just here into the entrance hall, so I'll see you inside. So after entering through to this entrance hall, you'll be able to see we have some LVT flooring beneath us, a central heating radiator and this staircase just here with an understairs storage cupboard including a light as well uh, but for now we're going to head through to the lounge which is immediately on your right hand side so a good decent sized lounge we have a bay fronted window to the right hand side looking back over towards the front of the property and as mentioned a generous sized living room here so we have a coal effect gas fire just over there central on that wall TV uh, points as well as telephone points, so data points as well. And we have some wall lights in here brightening things up too. There's also another doorway just there, but I'll let the camera come around and give you a view from all aspects as I open this door up. So as mentioned, a good size living room just here. And then we finally open through to a dining room just here in the center as we can see there's some double glazed french doors immediately off of this dining room taking you through to an extended space so dining room just here and then another reception room being this summer room or conservatory to the rear of the property with a glass roof above we have uh, tiled flooring in here some further french doors double glazed to the left going out to that patio or paved entertaining area we have some lighting above us, a sneak peek of the rear garden just there for you, as well as an aircon unit as well, just above me here. Um, so you can use that to keep yourselves cool or warm yourselves up depending on the time of year, of course. We head back through to the carpeted dining room here, and then as the camera comes through, it will open through to the kitchen. We have tile floor in here, some splash tiling on the walls. Wall and base units with roll top work surfaces. We can see the Neff um, integrated dishwasher just there next to the sink and drainer one and a half bowl. The central heating boiler just up there in the corner. That's a Worcester brand boiler. We then have a Neff electric oven and gas hob as well as the cooker hood above. We have those double glazed windows to the rear elevation. We also have an additional double glazed door here for another access point directly out onto that paved entertaining space. And then as we come back through to the entrance hall, immediately on your right towards the back of the garage, we have a slightly converted garage allowing space for this downstairs shower room. We have a WC corner shower unit, wash hand basin with vanity space, and a towel radiator, which is very handy as well. And then we're back to where we started in the entrance hall. So we're now going to take the staircase just here on the left hand side and I'll see you up on the landing. So up on the first floor landing we have some fitted carpet beneath us, the ceiling light point as you can see, and then we have loft access as well. Immediately to your left hand side though is bedroom one, so let's go and take a look. So to the front elevation we have that double glazed window, and as you'll see there's plenty of fitted storage in here too. We have some fitted floor to ceiling wardrobes to our left, wrapping around the room, and you'll also see some bedside tables matching the fitted wardrobe space. Central heating radiator underneath that window towards the front. And as we see, a little bit more of the wardrobe space across there, so all built in. Bedroom two is also to the front elevation. So as we come across the landing on the left hand side, we enter into bedroom two, also with some built in storage. So it's worth mentioning that all of the bedrooms here in this property 
of built-in storage. So just over there, we have some more views out towards the front. And then scoping around the room, around to your right-hand side now, there is a door with some further storage as well. If you follow me across the landing once again, we then head through to an extended space. So this is another bedroom. So bedroom three, another large bedroom. So another double room, again, with built-in storage just over in that corner next to the window. I'll let the uh, camera go over to that window if that's okay and just give you a bit of a sneak peek of the rear garden, which we'll see very shortly. And then back across the landing once again, we then go through to bedroom four once again with built-in storage in the corner of this room. Makes it a handy space. Either as a bedroom, or of course it could be another reception room, study, office. And there's the rear garden. As we head out onto the landing, you'll notice there's two doors on your left. The first one is the airing cupboard housing the immersion heater just there. And then as we head through to the modernized bathroom, you'll be able to see it's fully tiled, nice and low maintenance, low level WC, wash hand basin, vanity space, bath and electric shower units over the bath, as well as those mixer taps. So this summarises pretty much everything for upstairs and the interior of the home here at number three, Copswood Drive. We're now going to head outside and see the outdoor space. I'll see you there. So here we are. We're at the rear of the property now. You can see I'm just elevated slightly, stepping up onto this garden space here. But for now, I just want the camera to turn around and show you some of the space down this side access of the property. So just down there is an entrance through to the garage, so the integral garage. There's a window there from that shower room, outdoor tap, and of course the access to the front garden. As the camera comes back round, we'll see we have access points going through to the conservatory there. And then we step up onto a low maintenance garden towards the rear. So lots of privacy, so there's high fencing and hedges at the back of the garden flower bed surrounding, a small pond just here in the corner. As you can see, this lovely addition here, this conservatory space. Uh, so yeah, making the most of the summer or winter months. Um, and just down here is a low maintenance, paved, entertaining space too. This pretty much summarises everything for number three, Copswood Drive. And as always, please do get in touch with myself and the team in the Hereford office if you'd like some more details or to get booked in for a viewing. But for now, that's your virtual tour. I hope you've enjoyed it and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.